Yeah. Go, yeah, go ahead and look at. I'm streaming. Go ahead, look. Welcome, everyone. Alright guys, Ryan you watching? Not yet, oh, no I am. You watching? You see everything good? What? See everything alright? Yeah. Alright, let's get into it guys. So, in this video slash stream, I'm going to show you guys how to use CompuLight. Uh, I believe the default is E to pull up CompuLight and you have to hold it until it comes up. Mine, I changed mine to Z. So, I'm going to show you guys what Compu Light looks like right now before I pull anyone over. So, I'm just going to hold Z here. And there you go. Compu Light Computer System. So, you guys got PED records, vehicle records, and court cases. Now, this, this is basically all I can show you for right now until I pull someone over. But, you can go in here and check the PEDS records when you have someone pulled over. So I'll show you guys how to use it and let's get into it. Just gonna patrol here. I'm actually gonna show myself as not available for any calls here. Just give me one moment. Uh, it's unavailable for calls. Okay. 10 4. Alright, here we go. Just drive around here. Until we find someone. Oh, look, guys, there goes Cybertruck right there. Ain't that cool? It's actually very easy to install, too, guys. right through here. Still I'm not a racist. Alright guys, I'm going to pull this guy over because he just pulled out in front of me. So I'm going to put him as a blip. I'm going to light him up here. Hoping that he f pulls over here. There we go. Get him to pull over here. Come on. Come on. Pull over. Yep, there you go. Just like that. Alright, guys. There we go. So we got this person to stop right here. And I'm going to turn on my traffic advisories. Now I am going to get out of the vehicle here. Make sure there's no vehicle coming. Hello, sir. Can I see all your identification, please? Alright, now I'm just going to ask him if he has been drinking because it does say a strong smell of alcohol. So have you been drinking? One shot of vodka by an hour Alright, I'll have to test him for that in a minute. So guys, once you got his ID, you guys are going to go ahead and walk back to your police vehicle. 
and you're gonna bring up your CompuLite and you're gonna go to ped records and here is the person that you got your records from so this shows their first name, the last name their gender, their age, their date of birth, where they live their dr the this guy's license is valid he has been stopped five times he's not on probation he's not on parole he has an outstanding warrant which he does not he does not have a gun permit and no gun license uh... and his citation records are on a roadworthy vehicle failure failure to yield running a red light uh, he was, okay, yeah, you guys can see that, I'm not going to say that here, but I'm just going to go ahead and go into the vehicle records for the vehicle, and it says valid, valid, and it's not stolen. So, this was the guy that we just looked, and you guys can go in here to view owner records, but I'm going to create a citation here, uh, let's see, so, ch -ch 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 vehicle operation so th these are all the ones that you can charge him with you can go through and like double click them and you just go up here and just click submit but I'm gonna go in here and give him a ticket for uh, let's see failure to yield again so I'm gonna go here I'm gonna double click that I'm gonna go to submit citation or cancel and right here guys you can do a notice to appear that means he obviously a court case so I'm just gonna have him appear in court but it's alright so I'll just hit submit citations and as you, as you guys can see in the bottom right hand corner right here it has been issued to him and I can being that the court date is pending I can go into my CompuLite to court cases and here's his court case failure to yield on route 68 and we can just click reveal outcome and he was fined 240 243 dollars so i'm going to go and show him give him the ticket here so make sure there's no vehicles coming all right so i'm gonna get out here i'm gonna walk up to his vehicle and as you guys can see in the bottom left hand corner above my map it says to find him 300 dollars you have to do left shift and then page down so I'm gonna go ahead and do that here. Left shift, page down. Now it's giving him the ticket. And he's all set. So once you guys get back into your car, just like usual, he will leave. And I'm going to give this guy a ticket too. Ooh. And yes guys, this is a cyber truck. I have installed very easy to actually install guys All right, I guess that can be good enough here just back over here Put this guy by here we go I'm just gonna get out of the vehicle here just like last time guys walk up to the vehicle ask for the identification ask for the identification the driver seems nervous and sweating Alright, so Jin Alright, so we're gonna walk back to our vehicle just like last time. And we're gonna bring up our CompuLite by holding whatever key you have set it as. Default, I believe, is E. I'm gonna go to Pad Records. Here's his name. Click on him. License is valid. No outstanding warrants. He has been stopped twice. Probation, parole. Nope, everything looks good. Now I'm gonna know arrest records or citation records, so I'm gonna go ahead and create a citation for, let's see, what should I do here? Um, um where is it? Uh, crossing center divider. I'll give them that one. And you guys can also like pick other ones. It's just as many as you guys want. It doesn't have to just be one. 
Alright, so I think that's good. So I'm going to go up here and submit. Uh, and then you guys can unclick this if you don't want him to appear. So I'm just going to tell him he doesn't have to appear. I'm just going to check his vehicle real quick. This is the same king. Valid, valid. Not stolen. Alright, we're good. So we're going to back out of here. And we're going to go in here. And just like last time, it's going to be shift and then page down. And here you go. Find $150. We're going to get back in our vehicle. And there you go, guys. Just like that. Now it does appear that I have a blip up here, guys. Just going to shut it off. There we go. This guy, for some reason, is blipped, so I'm just gonna pull him over. Oh, he looks drunk. Pull this guy over here, guys. Looks like he's gonna run away from me, guys. Got his tire here. Ma'am, get out of the vehicle. Get out of the vehicle. Get on the ground. Why is it not letting me get her on the ground? Maybe if I do this. Can I do this? Let's see. Oh. That works that way too, guys. Let's stop the pad. Alright, so guys, now that I have a person under arrest here, I'm going to go ahead and I'll just search your vehicle here. Search the vehicle. Alright, nothing there. Now, I can use stop the pad and I can obtain the plate number. So I'm going to go ahead and obtain the plate number. As you guys can see, it was added to the CompuLite. Now I'm just gonna tow the vehicle here. Flatbed, backup needed on Route 68. Now I'm going to grab her here. There we go. I'm just gonna take her to jail myself. Release her. See here. There we go, guys. So she's in the car here. I'm just gonna get back in the vehicle here. I'm just gonna pull off to the side over here at this gas station. And here I'm just gonna file. I'm going to put a arrest on her uh... Kate Andrews so I'm gonna create an arrest report here now I'm going to do evading arrest and let's see I'm do reckless driving and let's see um... And guys just looking to see if any of these fall into the category of her here I think that's good so I'm gonna submit charges here and as you guys can see down here it's got a pending court case so I can go over to court cases and we're looking for Kate Andrews go, go to court cases and here's Kate Andrews Offenses were evading arrest and reckless driving. Reveal outcomes. 
She was fined $637 and her license is suspended for 22 months. And she has 11 months in prison. And for the reckless driving, she was fined $659. And she was suspended, her license was suspended for 7 months. And she was granted probation. Alright, so there you guys go. So I'm just going to route to the nearest jail here. Go take her to the nearest jail. I'll just go code 3, why not? If you guys are wondering how my lights are so bright, uh, I have a mod called Radiance. If you guys would like to know how to install that, let me know. And I will help you guys install that. It's actually very simple. Okay guys, if you guys do enjoy it, please make sure to like and subscribe and turn on all notifications so you guys get every single time I get notified that I am either live or I have uploaded a new video. Alright guys, so we're almost here. Guys, I'm just gonna kill my siren here. So we are taking her to the prison. Kill our lights here. Thank you. I'll pull up here. And I'm gonna take her on myself. Walk up to her. Going to grab her. Here we go. Walk in through here. I'll put her in the jail cell here. And release her. And there she is. Actually, I'll just release the handcuffs here. that she is in jail. Next time you're there we going go. To jail. And there we go guys. So if you guys do enjoy this stream please make sure to smash that like button and turn on notifications. And like always subscribe. Alright guys, go check out No Destiny, I'm sorry, 100 Ping No Destiny, keeps changing it on me. Go check out 100 Ping No Destiny on YouTube, he's right here on YouTube, go check him out. And guys, it's going to be a wrap for this episode, if you guys do enjoy it, please make sure to like and subscribe and turn on notifications. And we will catch you guys on the next one, peace out guys.